What is going on guys? It is the Phantom Michael and today is a little bit of a different video for you guys. Um, we're going to be doing the Pokemon positivity tag video. Um, just because I just wanted to talk a little bit. I feel like our community has just been under kind of like a shakedown as of late. Um, really don't really know what direction everything is going to go into. So I just wanted to make this just kind of like a support system for all my friends who are still doing YouTube and really enjoy what they're doing. So let's just get right into it and just have some fun. So uh, down there in the description, I'm going to be posting all the rules and stuff. So we're just going to go ahead with our five questions and I'm going to talk a little bit about myself. So question number one, why did you join the Pokemon community? Um, so I've been watching uh, PokeTubers for about five years now, about five years. Um, and I just really thought it was something really cool because I've always been into Pokemon. Um, I got Pokemon Blue when I was really young. Um, actually, I, I was born in 94, so I um, wasn't old enough when the games actually dropped. But I played Pokemon Blue while everyone else was playing Pokemon Crystal, I think, had dropped out. Then I kind of finally understood what Pokemon was. So, um, <clears throat> so I started off with Blue, and I kind of went from there. And then after I played Blue for the first time, I just fell in love. I picked up uh, Generation 3. I got Pokemon Ruby. My friend got Sapphire. We kind of just did the whole, you know, we each had, because we traded each other, one person restarted the game over and over again. And uh, we had all three of the starters, Torchic, Trico, and Mudkip, and then our other three Pokemon, whatever they were. Um, so, and a lot of the other kids in my neighborhood all had uh, Ruby or Sapphire at the time, so we all kind of battled and traded and played together. Um, but the reason why I really joined the community was because of the fact that I feel like I can show you guys how much fun it is just to be yourself. Um, and I really like connecting with other people and I really enjoy it um, when like a topic gets brought up and we have our back and forth conversations. Um, that's really the big thing. Conversations and meeting people is really the biggest reason why I joined the community is making videos on YouTube. So yeah. Um, question number two, what do you love about the community and the Pokemon franchise itself? So I kind of talked a little bit earlier about the Pokemon franchise. Um, for me as a kid, I feel like it was more like an escape from reality. You know, you're this uh, hero, you're a kid, you're a hero. And I played Pokemon when I was a kid, so like that's kind of, I guess, the, the reason why I keep playing it even now as an adult. Um, you're just really in the world, you, you are kind of a nobody at first, and then you grow into this great hero based on your morals and how you treat others and your partner Pokemon. So I think that's why I really love the franchise um, about the community. Um, now, I talk with a lot of other PokeTubers that are like on my level, but um, I really haven't never had a bad experience communicating with a PokeTuber or a Pokemon theorist. Because I don't know, you have, you have like two kind of branches. You have people who play Pokemon games and people who do more like the uh, theory... Um, theory or like news topics and I've reached out and talked to both um, content creators and actually have never had a bad experience so that, that's I can say that personally never had a bad experience communicating with any kind of other PokeTuber ever so I think that's why I really love the community um my favorite video that I have ever created definitely right now it's got to be the uh, Moonstone all Moonstone location video that I have on my channel it's got 5,000 views it's my most viewed video not a lot of views honestly like coming from you know obviously much larger PokeTubers but for me I'm the most proud of that video I love it it looks great and absolutely my favorite um second favorite though has got to be oh man DJ Spin and I did a did our go lock and whenever I lost McLeod that was probably my my second favorite video I've ever created just because the struggle i was so upset i knocked my camera down that's how upset i was so yeah probably my second favorite video um name and talk about someone of some other great content creators in the pokemon community let's talk about that um shady penguin is someone who sticks out as one of my favorite a drive obviously 
Um, I actually was in a contest that A-Drive had, and I actually won his copy of Pokemon Sun, so that's awesome that he did in a Warlock with the Munching Orange. So, super, super cool guy. Um, Image ATV, Jubilee, great, great content creators. Um, Loxon and Noggin, really love them. Uh, Proto Mario, another one of my favorite, more theory videos. Mystic Umbreon. Man, Mystic Umbreon and me go way back, honestly. Um, I knew that guy before he even had, like, less than 300 subs, 400 subs maybe. I knew him. Um, can't forget about the guys that are on my level now. We're looking at DJ Spinda, my best friend, the best man at my wedding. He is an awesome, outstanding guy. Um, I'm really into some Palette University made by Cool Trainer Gavin. Go check him out. Fantastic PC Bloodmaster Joe Schmo, uh, really cool guys. Really love interacting and talking to those guys. Um, so yeah, those all those PokeTubers are fantastic people, and I can't really speak about personal characteristics based on like those higher tiered PokeTubers, but I can definitely tell you DJ Spinda, Cool Trainer Gavin, PC Bloodmaster Joe Schmo, outstanding guys. Mystic Mystic Umbreon, I've talked to him on the phone plenty of times, so. He's, he's another one that uh, I know personally. So, yeah. So, we're going to go over to the best part of this video where we are going to tag some content curators in here. And I think I'm going to go ahead and tag maybe four. Let's tag four. So, we got, I'm going to tag my boy, DJ Spinda. I'm going to tag PC Bloodmaster. I'm going to tag Cool Trainer Gavin. And I'm going to go ahead and tag the Canto Critic. That is another guy that I will tell you that I enjoy watching his videos. Um, he's a little bit, I think he only has 60 less subs than I do. But his content, his editing is outstanding and I really, really enjoy him. And we're going to go ahead and throw five. Why not? Joe Schmo. Joe Schmo, make a video, please. So yeah, there we have it. There's our five PokeTubers. I just tagged him out, just called him out. So yeah, go check him out. Links will be in the description. Please check them out. They are really good guys. I really enjoy working with them. So, there you have it. All right, you guys. I've been the Phantom Michael. I'm going to get the heck out of here, and I will see you guys in the next one.